and welcome back to another Fine and Country property tour. My name is Fenella and today we're at this astounding five bedroom barn conversion which is in the village of West Raynham in the North Norfolk countryside. Now we've had lots of requests for more country properties so if you've not seen our other tours please go and check them out but for now let's get on with the tour. impressed by the design and styling of the entire property but I wanted to start the tour right here in this beautiful fitted kitchen. Now this is my favourite style of kitchen, this is an English shaker kitchen so it's timeless in its design and you can identify a shaker kitchen by the centre panelling you have in the cabinets here. So this style is perfect for any sort of property, old or new and I think it just fits perfectly in this property. The arrangement is symmetrical in its layout, which is so aesthetically pleasing. So up here, there are display cabinets, which look so stylish, and then open wooden shelving, which is perfect for displaying your favorite crockery pieces. And then having this type of layout where you don't have the wall cabinets just means that it feels so much more open and bright, especially with the side lights letting in light from here and then the cottage style windows as well. Then of course you've got this huge kitchen island in the centre here which has been painted in black adding a really nice contrast. This is perfect for gathering around whenever I'm at my families or friends I always find I'm congregated in the kitchen so this is definitely perfect for hosting. There are also these cognac leather bar stools at the end which look so stylish and the colour adds a bit of warmth to the space and matches with some of the wooden elements we've got in here so the engineered oak flooring and the open wooden shelving. And then, of course, these oversized exposed pendants above add another touch of warmth and really bring your eye into the middle of the space. So with such a high quality kitchen, of course, you have the appliances to match. We've got this really stylish black range master with an induction hob on top. You've got five rings there. And then I love a metro tile backsplash. So this looks really cool as well. Um, and then moving on through, you'll notice all of the appliances are matching, so even down to the kettle. We've got a Miele microwave, a really nice Samsung fridge freezer. And then over here, there is this Range Master coffee machine, which makes me so excited. I would definitely be using this every single day. Accessed from the kitchen, you have a really spacious utility room with the same style of shaker cabinetry again with wall cabinets as well. So you've got plenty of storage um, and then it's also got direct access to the rear garden which is so pretty but I'll show you that in a bit. For now I want to focus on this dining area. So we've got the pendant lights again. Um, above this new timber table, you can see we've got plenty of seating for eight people, so it's perfect for hosting dinner parties. Then these black painted chairs contrast really beautifully with the table, but they match perfectly with the kitchen island and the appliances as well. Not only is the property great for entertaining, but its location offers a variety of local hotspots and amenities. Golland House is situated in West Raynham, a small village with a primary school and village hall. Approximately six miles away is the nearby market town of Fakenham, where you'll find a range of independent shops, cafes and other eateries, supermarkets, a modern GP surgery and various attractions. Nearby Fakenham Racecourse is an exciting day out for all ages, offering races throughout the year and places to eat for visitors. For lovers of golf, Fakenham Golf Course is situated just next door. The spectacular North Norfolk coast with its celebrated beaches is a short drive away. Wells next to the sea offers a beautiful beach where you can hire a beach hut for a fun day out. Only two miles from Golland House is Raynham Hall, 
a seat of the Townsend family for nearly 400 years, where on select open days, visitors can enjoy music recitals, house tours, and annual parties. Home of BBC's Springwatch programme, Pensthorpe National Park is a multi-award winning 200 acre reserve, only a 15 minute drive away. So this is the entrance hall area. I entered through the front door here. As soon as you walk in, you're drawn to this beautiful bespoke floating staircase. You can see the staircase is supported by this iron beam here, which is black. This matches perfectly with this elegant black railing, which goes all the way up to the open landing. You've got these wooden rising steps all the way up, which have lighting underneath and then glass panelling at the back. From the moment you enter the property, you're greeted by so much space. It's open plan in design and you can tell a lot of thought has gone into the layout and the design of the home. There are two storey picture windows which are on both sides, so you've got lots of light shining through. It's so bright and spacious and I love the styling as well. So. The colours that are in the cushions feature in the colours in the rug and then all of the furniture is all pointed towards this super warm wood burning stove which on a cold day like today I am really appreciating. So coming up the stairs I've just noticed a bit more of the detailing on the railing here so if you look all the grooves sort of resemble tree branches and this was bespokely made by a local ironmonger. Then there's also this specially commissioned light fixture here hanging from this triple vaulted ceiling and just behind there we have a really unique feature which is giving us a bit of a view into the bedroom so let's go and have a look. So I am obsessed with this bedroom especially the styling I'd say this is a modern farmhouse sort of style or a mo modern country cottage sort of style. I love the touches of blush pink in the cushions here and the sofa, this is the most me sofa I've ever seen and then you've also got touches of pink in the Persian rug here. Then of course touches of black just as you have throughout the whole home and then over here I mentioned this really unique feature. This is a reclaimed window, goes from the floor all the way to ceiling height um, and it's a reclaim, reclaimed factory window and it actually opens as well. I love that you get such a great view of downstairs and then of course this window lets in so much natural light but I think if this was my bedroom I'd probably have a sheer curtain to go across so you get just as much natural light but just a bit of privacy. Over here you've got your very own dressing table and then of course you have your very own ensuite. This is such a sophisticated bathroom. You've got a black and white freestanding bathtub here with black fixtures which also matches the shower fixtures and the radiator behind me as well. I really love the juxtaposition of the new next to this exposed flint wall. It really makes a statement. Across the landing on this floor, there are two further bedrooms, both with modern en suites, again with gray wall tiles, white Carrara marble style flooring, fitted sink cabinets, and black iron fittings and fixtures. Downstairs you will also find two further bedrooms, one with an ensuite, plus a guest WC. Any of these bedrooms can be reconfigured to offer an additional reception room or a home office, depending on what suits your lifestyle. Finally, I want to show you one more super cool feature of this bedroom suite, so come with me through here. This space has been ideally designed so that you can have a walk-in wardrobe, but what I really want to show you is just up here. 
So this area of the bedroom suite takes me right back to when I was younger, exploring a new house, trying to find the most hidden away place to play. I think this area is so cool. You could use it as a snug area or a reading room or a home office if you work from home. You've also got the great views onto the garden and then down here views onto the bedroom and then even further down to the ground floor. So I want to come out here to show you these beautiful rear gardens. They're sort of a cottage style garden and they've been landscaped with a lovely path down here. So there's direct access to the road. So if you like a country dog walk, you can come through and then go through the utility room if you've got your muddy boots so you're not tracking everything through the house. There's also direct access onto the patio area here, which is perfect for entertaining. The property benefits from an electric gated entrance controlled by a smart home security system. Accessed via a long private driveway, the home also has a garage to fit one car, a cart lodge to fit two cars, plus plenty of space for additional vehicles. I hope you've enjoyed spending the day here with me at Golland House. I've had so much fun looking around. Now, if you enjoyed this country property tour, please don't forget to like the video, comment down below, and don't forget to subscribe to this YouTube channel. Now, I'm really cold out here, so I'm going to get myself back inside in front of the fire, and I'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.